Hey sweet friends, welcome back to my home. If you're new here, I'm Rebecca, welcome. Today, I have a haul to share with you. I've had a couple of hauls that I've missed sharing with you, and you've probably seen a few items uh, throughout my home when I'm decorating, but I have one to share with you that I went to Peddler's Mall in Somerset, Kentucky a couple of days ago. Some of the items are going to the booth and some of the items I'm keeping, but I wanted to share those with you so that if you should visit the booth, you'll know what I'm putting in there. But I've got some a little something. If you hear something in the background, I've got laundry going. Uh, one of the first things that I found is right over here. And this is a bicycle, a metal bicycle that you can hang on the wall. It's got a little thing, two little things on the back to hang it up. And I could also hang this on my front porch. And how adorable is this? You know that I have one out there for spring, but how adorable is this? And I only paid $11 for this. So I was happy to find that. Another item that I found that I want to use in my booth, in my home. And this was just a large basket for $4.95. It's got one little place that I need to glue, but I can put dishes or if I make things for the booth and have a bunch of them, I can put them in here, put a tag on it, and this is just a, a, a really nice large basket that I could use for home or the booth. And if I do have it in the booth, I will either mark it at a price I probably don't want to sell it for, or I may put NFS, not for sale. Another thing that I found, and it's for spring and summertime, and it's this big watering can. It's not really for watering. It's just decorative only. And for this, I paid $7.99. It's still got a sticker that needs to, but I will clean this up and I may use this in my home for the summer, or I may put it down in the booth, but I paid $8 for that. couple of little chickens in the woven. I have never seen these. I've seen three of them. These were the, the better two of all three. They wanted two dollars a piece. They're in need of the little red. Uh, I don't know what you call that on their throat and up here, but I have some red felt that I'm going to put on there and just fix those real quick. But two dollars a piece little woven chickens how adorable speaking of baskets this is what looks like an antique wire basket the price was taken off of it uh, i'm sure that i probably paid around five or six dollars maybe for it. Again, I can use in my home and I may use it in the booth or I may sell it. I'm not sure uh, where I'm gonna go with everything just yet. And another little bicycle. This one was so adorable for $5. It's a shelf sitter. Maybe sitting here in my kitchen, but, or on my buffet, but this is too adorable. I just love all the little bicycles. It just screams summer to me, spring and summer. I have been looking for some old marbles and I found these at $2.99 for the jar and 
I'm just going to take this old primitive style and put something more of a farmhouse style all for three bucks. I'm always on the lookout for these galvanized houses. I love to use them during the holidays, especially around Christmas. I am thinking of doing a whole galvanized area uh, this Christmas, but this one was just $6. It does have a little light, <laughs> still lights up. And for $6, and I, I have one or two to go with this as a collection. So this is for my home for the holidays. This is a creamer and it has milk embossed in it. And the sugar and the creamer was $4. This one says sugar and there's the lid. Just a little shaped like houses, how adorable. And this will go in the booth. Seen this little farmhouse wood tray? Uh, it's got a, I think, loose right here. It just needs to be tightened up, and that's it. I believe this was an item from Hobby Lobby. I paid four dollars and fifty cents. This is going to go in the booth. Another little farmhouse creamer. Blessed and grateful for a dollar ninety-five. I've seen this little angel, sitting angel, for $1.99, and I know that a lot of people love these for the holidays. This one doesn't, I don't see any nicks or anything really adorable uh, shelf sitter, and this is going to go in the booth for the holidays. Another farmhouse little item was this uh, pig, gave $1.95, and his arms and legs are movable you can sit in, sit or stand and uh, very very cute and it's cloth linen cloth but how cute that will go in the booth this little piggy is a butter dish I found it at a yard sale and thought I would put it in my haul. I love the light blue colors. I love the florals on it. A really cute ceramic butter dish of a pig that I'm going to use. There was two of them. One of them is already in the booth for sale. And I got them for $2 a piece. But I'm going to keep this one and use it in my kitchen because I am loving the florals for the summer. And speaking of florals, I have a few things that I'm putting together as a tea set and not anything uh, really matching, but I'm going to share the pieces that I found.